Set Master presents some. Um, it's I uh, probably from the looks like early 90s, perhaps maybe late 80s. Boombox thing that I'm showing here made by Blurry Image, by the way. Ah, stupid hammer. U Unitech model CX450, and um. The other parts are up at the top here. You can see there the equalizer and all that stuff. Tuning and the it has high speed dubbing and stuff. Anyway, in dubbing mode, I can record at 354 IPS on cassette using external microphones or the radio with external microphones plugged in. If you have if you have nothing if you have no microphones plugged in on the back and you're using the the dubbing mode, it, it, it won't record off the radio or through the internal microphones. So I have external microphones plugged in, these nice Sony ones, as you saw me use one of these in a lot of my YouTube presentations. And, um, anyway, I have it not hooked up to these speakers, but I have it hooked up to these big three-way allied speakers that are normally hooked up to my Panasonic RS-280S there. But I hooked this thing up to it, and it actually gives great sound through them. Turn it on. Play this cassette here. We're playing the best music in the world. Recorded off the radio, of course. <laughs> of that beat. I love that sound. I love it. Yeah. Okay, now for our recording first of microphones here on this cassette at normal speed. Okay, I have to press record and play at the same time with separate fingers. Just like Emerson Collie's unit. Anyway, um... Okay, speaking for the Cassette Master presentation, to this left microphone, this right microphone, of course the video is mono, but the sound on this thing is stereo, so... Okay, switches. 3 and 3 fourths speed. Okay, now run for 3 and 3 fourths inches per second speed on the cassette tape format. You can hear the motor running fast, see the cassette tape running fast there. Oh, so it's back to one and seven eighths, and stop. Okay, rewind extra fast. Fingers, just like Emerson Collie's unit. Anyway, um, okay, speaking for the cassette master presentation, to this left microphone, this right microphone. Okay, let's see. Okay, now run for three and three fourths inches per second. Speed on the cassette tape format. Sounds hilarious. Running fast there, huh? She's back in one of some minutes. And stop. Okay, I'm gonna rewind it some. Okay. For the cassette mask. Okay. Okay, now for radio recording. Put it on radio. I think it's this. Pop foul into the third base seats. Michael Vick. Oh, wow. nine KLAZ. Okay. Can record at three and three fourths too here for extra good sound quality. And then 
Move into cassette tape mode. Record it three reports two here. Whoa, it got my, the microphones too. I didn't know you could do that. So they can hear me speaking. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. I think it picked up the sound from the speakers into the microphones when I did that. Ah, uh, that's not normal. I thought I think it recorded straight from the radio before one time. I'm not exactly sure. Huh. Huh. Well. <laughs> still. Set tape format. It had kind of a you know muffled sound. I think it. I think it was recording through the microphone. Uh, maybe if I unplug one microphone on there and try recording off the radio. I'll try that. Record this part when I only get on one channel, but. Extra good sound. Huh, my little thing didn't work right. Okay. I, th I thought I would record direct from the radio at, at the 3N34s there, but it didn't. I might modify the unit so that I can um, record normally at 3N34s. Okay, bye.